with up with up with up with up with up with up sun seeds with up this your girl mystic sunflower i'm back to give you guys a collective general energy reading it doesn't matter what your sign is sun seeds for this message to resonate sun seeds please make sure you use discernment take what resonate and leave the rest behind okay please and thank you let's get you guys some messages okay you might hear the rain. It is loud. It is pouring down. <laughs> and y'all know I felt the rain. <laughs> let's get into these messages. Let's let's see what's going on. That rain sounds so beautiful. It's like something is clearing out. It's clearing out. <laughs> holy Spirit, Holy Spirit, divine. My answer for the highest way light. My spirit guides, my holy angels. Archangel Michael, please protect me while I channel the energies for my collective sun seeds. Anything other than highest white light, please close and shut that door. Please and thank you, Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, what is the current energy for my collective sun seeds? Please and thank you. One of the most important messages they need to know at this time. Okay, thank you. So Spirit is saying your hard work is paying off. New moon in Capricorn. Spirit is saying your hard work is paying off. So something you've been working hard at, Sensei, is definitely paying off. Under the bottom, we have expect a powerful change. New moon in eclipse. So something is eclipsing out your life. Okay? And it's going to be a powerful change. Yes, look. Spirit is saying luck is on your side. New moon in Sagittarius. Emotions are running high. Um, confidence is the key to success. New moon in Leo. Work through your fears. New moon in Scorpio. Something that you release in, something that you cutting out, it's going to be a powerful change. Yes. It's going to be a powerful change. Spirit is saying, look, it's definitely on your side at this time. Okay. Holy Spirit, give me some more messages from my collective something. Please and thank you. We have growth. Okay, so you guys have definitely been growing. I'm hearing expanding. Whatever this growth is, it's going to bring you a lot of peace. I just heard balance. Give me more Holy Spirit. Yeah, knowledge. Something you know now. All this blue is, is giving me peace. Yeah, purple under the bottom. You have ascended. <laughs> Your hard work is paying off. You have definitely ascended. Mm-hmm. Your hard work is definitely put, um, you have definitely ascended sun seeds, okay? Whatever this growth is, whatever this knowledge is, whatever you've been studying, it's paying off. I'm hearing you very knowledgeable. I just heard ancient wisdom, spiritual wisdom. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm also picking up, somebody has been watching your growth. Somebody has been watching you grow, expand, working hard. Somebody could be in sorrow about your growth, how much you have changed. Something about you is not the same anymore. Somebody is watching that. Somebody has been watching this growth about you. Mm, what's under the sin? Yeah, love. Love is on its way to you. Mm -hmm. Something about your growth, it makes... It could, all right. It makes somebody sad because it says, it says, expect the powerful change. Luck is on your side. Emotions are running high. Confidence is the key. What do you need to release? Somebody who did eclipse out your life, somebody who you let go of, um, they know that there's some type of powerful change that's headed your way because luck is on your side. The day emotions could be running high. Something about your confidence. Somebody could be intimidated by your confidence. Something about you is just like, real organic it's real something is real something is natural that comes to come whatever this is for you it's something that comes natural you have definitely ascended somebody is watching your growth and with this knowledge somebody is learning something and but it's make it's giving me like it's, it's putting this person like in a sorrow yeah somebody is feeling some type of way 
Somebody with the, your hard work is paying off with this growth and knowledge. Somebody could have been trying to block your fortune, trying to block something from you, but you have ascended. It's like it's, you made it. Somebody could really be intimidated by that. Give me Holy Spirit. Give me some messages, please, and thank you. <clears throat> thank you. Ooh, that's a lot, Holy Spirit. Eight of Cups. Whoever you walked away from. Page of Wands. <laughs> yeah, Queen of Wands. I'm telling you, it's something about your confidence. Whatever <laughs> you real confident at something, and it's bringing you in a lot of success. Nine of Cups. Wish fulfillment. Four of Pentacles, Four of Wands. Yeah, somebody could have been trying to hold you back from, a, you know, a relationship, some type of stability, a home. Yeah, some, somebody doesn't like this, but you have made it. Yeah. It says waiting for cups under the bottom. It's giving me that somebody wanted to block an opportunity from, um, from coming in for you. But you have grown it. You have grown. It's like you have grown... And you kept working hard, and now it's paying off. Eight of Swords to the Six of Swords. Yeah, somebody wanted to have you bonded, but you're moving away to common waters. What's after the Six of Swords? Yeah, Three of Swords. Like, somebody secretly is in, they hurting. Somebody secretly, oh, excuse me, confirmation, Five of Wands. Somebody could see you as competition. But in secret with the moon being, what's being hidden is that this person is hurt. Because you have ascended. Somebody is hurt that your hard work is paying off. Somebody is hurt that some type of beautiful new reality that you created for yourself is definitely here with the Nine of Cups. Like, your wishes is coming true. With the Four of Pentacles and, and with the Four of Wands, it's like somebody either wanted to hold you back. Somebody wanted to lay something for you. But no, that's not going down. Yeah, they see you as straight competition. Hmm. That was a lot of cards. Whoever this energy is that you're eclipsing out your life or you're walking away from, somebody is just watching you and they just depressed. They just can't believe you did it. They can't believe you have the confidence to move on and do this. It's something that comes natural to you. You know, your confidence. I heard your beauty. Page of Wands to the Queen of Wands. That's somebody that's very, very, very attractive. And I always tell you, when I when I say attractive, I'm talking about the inner. Because whatever's on the inner, it's going to shine. Okay? You could be beautiful on the outside, but if your inner is ugly, it sure is, it's going to show. And it doesn't, you know, confirmation with all them sirens. Any more Holy Spirit? Yeah, you've been hit the moon card. Any more Holy Spirit, the moon? Ooh. Something could have happened two weeks ago or something could be happening in two weeks. But something that was hitting. You could have realized something two weeks ago. Your intuition could have been nudging you about something. Give me more Holy Spirit. Somebody was trying to hold you up. King of Wands. Something could have been going on for three years. It's like something about some 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 type of action. Yeah, not a wands. It's like you moving forward, you taking some type of action on something. <clears throat> it bothers someone. It makes someone insecure. It makes someone insecure by you moving forward. Because I heard earlier building like a new reality for yourself. It got this person emotions running high. Somebody don't like the fact that you got luck on your side. They don't like the fact that you about to get this powerful change. Somebody doesn't like the fact that, okay, King of Wands, Nine of Wands, you still kept going. You still kept working through your fears. Like somebody wanted you to stop. Somebody wanted you to feel feel neglected, left out. It's like you were still working through your fears. You were still you still kept going. You didn't give up. Give me more. What's this Nine of Wands energy, Holy Spirit? Nine of Wands. I cannot make it up. Yes, somebody wanted you to give up, but you kept working through your fears. It's like you kept going. You didn't give up. This could be somebody, because I did see the Three of Pentacles. This could be somebody at your workplace. Or somebody you just worked with, you know, take it how it resonates. Give me another card on the Eight of Pentacles, Holy Spirit. Mm. 
Yes, the full card. <laughs> What's the full card? Thank you, Holy Spirit. Nine of Swords. Somebody wanted to have you in your head, have you scared. Somebody wanted you to feel trapped. Um, this person could have been projecting in, um, anxiety, you know, uh, making you feel like you weren't worthy enough. You'll be a fool if you work towards that. You'll be a fool if you take that chance. No. Give me a card on this nine of swords. If you take action to that, you'll be a fool. No. <laughs> Something could happen a week ago. Give me a card on the nine of swords, Holy Spirit. Yeah, six of pentacles. Yeah, something is beautiful that's coming into coming in for you. Mm hmm Some type of financially financial abundance is headed your way. Because you kept going. You was working through your fears. Yes. Damn. <clears throat> Excuse me. Six of pentacles to the queen of pentacles. Some type of beautiful financial opportunity is coming. It's headed your way. That's going to bring you in a lot of abundance. Something that you've been working really hard on. And, and whatever you've been working hard on, it's like somebody's studying you and they sad, sunsees, because they like, how did you do it? I wanted you to be, I wanted you to be insecure. I wanted you to be in your head. I wanted you to feel like whatever this battle you was going through, it was yours. It was never yours. God said the battle ain't yours. Somebody did not want you to keep working, but you kept working through your fears. It was like somebody was trying to block your whatever this financial opportunity for you. But they knew they could never block it. So what they wanted to do with the full card to the Nine of Swords, somebody wanted you to try to self-sabotage this. But the Spirit is saying the first card out, your hard work is paying off. You kept going. You kept going. Something could have been going on for, I'm telling you, up to three years. Six months. <clears throat> but something you realized either two weeks ago or a week ago. About this person. Mm. Give me a card on the King of Wands. Holy Spirit. King of Wands. High Priestess. Your intuition. Yeah, two of swords. Somebody wanted to block you from seeing something. Somebody was hoping they could block your intuition. Ooh. What you did... But see, whoever this person is, I, you coming up as this high priestess, you realize that somebody wanted to have you as a still me. They wanted to make things difficult for you about whatever this choice was that you was eclipsing out your life. Yeah, somebody wanted to make something stressful for you. But with the high priestess being here, you see it, you know it. Like somebody wanted to have you as a still me. Give me another card, high priestess. Ooh, child. Yeah, somebody was doing black magic. Oh, or what do we call on the devil? And if it wasn't just because with the high priest of the devil, that's something definitely dark. Uh, for some of you guys, again, somebody could have just wanted to have you self sabotage because they couldn't, you can't, they couldn't block nothing that God rightfully gave to you. So what they wanted to do was to have you in fear with this nine of swords, have you self sabotage something, have you afraid, have you thinking that something couldn't happen for you. Somebody wanted to scare you up. Somebody wanted to make you feel like you would never have balance in your life. One and five, breaking down to a six. What's this devil card? Holy Spirit, what's the devil? Yes, the star. They knew they couldn't block this. They knew. They knew that. They knew that. Somebody was afraid of you being this star. Queen of Pentacles, Six of Pentacles. They was afraid of that. Mm-mm-mm. Ooh, yeah. Give me a card on this star. The star. Thank you, Holy Spirit. Yeah, set a one. Somebody wanted to make something hard for you because they knew that Somebody could definitely be intimidated by you. Somebody could be watching you and they could be literally intimidated by you. They could see you as competition. Somebody don't really like this. Like something about you, you just a natural born leader. You a go-getter. And somebody wanted to, you know, keep you as a stillman. How can I keep you stuck? How, how can I have you at crossroads? At a crossroad. Because I know that once this star succeeds, somebody feel like it's over for them. How can I burden you? How can I how can I make you feel like feel overloaded? You understand? Make you feel like you know everything is weighing down on you. But that's not true. Ooh, somebody was trying to mess with your mind. 
I'm telling you, the Nine of Swords to the Two of Swords. Uh-uh. Somebody, give me a card on the Ten of Wands, Ten of Wands Holy Spirit. Ten of Wands. I'm not staying in this energy long. Yeah, Emperor. We have Pisces, Capricorn, Aquarius, Aries, Cancer, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, Aquarius. Mm. Somebody didn't want you to boss up. They didn't want you to boss up and take action. Give me a card in the Emperor. This could be a father figure, a boss of yours. Give me a card in the Emperor, Holy Spirit. The Emperor. Thank you. The Emperor is clarified with the Five of Cups and Four Swords. Somebody is in regret because you healed. You healed. Mm-hmm. Somebody wanted you to be sad, feeling lost, feeling abandoned, feeling abandoned, feeling, feeling out in the cold. Okay. Four swords. Mm -mm. Something came to rest. You have grown from the situation. Whatever they were trying to do to you, you see that. You see it clearly. Somebody wanted to bring you back to a place where you no longer at. Like whatever you was facing, whatever you was going through, somebody was hoping I could keep you stuck. So you wouldn't move forward. But you actually wind up work. It says work through your fears. Give me a card on this five of cups, Holy Spirit. Five of cups. You hit the world card. A cycle was ending. A cycle was closed. What's the world? The world, Holy Spirit. Cards falling on the floor. Yes. Yes. The sword. The um. The world card is clarified with the six of swords. Yes. Something is closing out for me. <laughs> Listen. One door closes, another one open. You're moving away to calmer water. Spirit said, expect a powerful change. New moon and eclipse. Yes, this, whoever this energy is, they get eclipse out your life. And you're moving away to calmer waters. Luck is on your side. And you're getting this because you was confident. You was confident to still go, still work, still work through your fears, still keep it moving. And it says, what did you need to release? You let it go. Mm. What's under the bottom? You had a death card. Something is changing. Eight of, um, six of cups. Yeah, what's changing is six of cups in reverse. You're not going back to the past. Whether that's a mindset or physically going around whoever this energy was. Somebody wanted to have you in your somebody wanted to have you in the head in your head about the past. They wanted whatever. Whatever you're going through in the past, they wanted to, to hold you up to stop your forward movement. Oh, ew. What's the moon card? That's what was hidden from you, Sunseeds. But with the high princess being here, you see that. Queen of Wands, Page of Pentacles. There's some type of beautiful new opportunity that's being granted to you. Mm-hmm. This could be somebody who does something in divination as well. What's the um give me a card on the page of pentacles? Somebody didn't want this um whatever you were setting your, your attentions to, you know, your heart and your goals towards. Somebody didn't like the fact that you was confident and you was going to get it. So somebody was like, How can how can I mess with this person confident? How can I make them feel like they're not worthy enough? Because they're this person too confident. How can I knock them down? How can I knock them down? So the, the, the only thing, because they, could, they couldn't stop what was destined for you, so they wanted to have you in your head, so you wouldn't feel confident about going towards this new beginning. That's what their whole attention was to get you to self-sabotage just, just for yourself, to make you feel like your hard work wasn't paying off. Ew. Page of Pentacles, Holy Spirit. Somebody doesn't like your beauty, your confidence. It bothers them. It's like, not only do this person, is this person beautiful? Because I picked that up in the beginning. Not only is this person beautiful, you're beautiful. You take care of yourself. Okay? You got a nice bag. You don't want for nothing. Okay? Luck seems to always be on your side. It's like, uh-uh. How can I? And no matter what was going on around you, even with this devil being here, you still was working through your fears. You still kept working. Period. What's the page of Pentacles, Holy Spirit? Ooh. 
Okay. Something could have been going on for five years. Something could have been going on for two years. For some of you guys, somebody could have been doing something up to seven years. Will of Fortune, Judgment, Knight of Pentacles, Queen of Cups, The Lovers, Three of Pentacles, Five of Swords. It's like a bunch of jealous people working up against whoever this leader is. Somebody who's in this high frame position. Mm. Can I have a card on it? These cards are just... I'm not even going to take the ones on the floor because somebody don't want me to get this out. What's the Page of Pentacles? Page of Pentacles. Yes, the sun. Whatever this new opportunity is, they know it's going to make you happy. They know it's going to make you happy. Yes, the, I told you earlier, look, the seven of wands to the magician. Somebody knew that you could be a powerful manifester. Somebody was trying to block your manifestation because they know with the queen of wands, the page of pentacles, the sun. You, if you happy, <laughs> like if you happy and you, your spirits is up, like you manifesting like crazy. Somebody like, how can I, how can I bring, because it says confidence is the key to success, new moon and Leo. It's like, how can I knock this person's confidence down so they can block, so I can block them from manifesting the way they do. Somebody is a hater, five of pentacles. Somebody wanted to see you out in the cold. Yeah, somebody wanted to have you in lack. They're a hater, son, seeds. Two of wands. Somebody don't like the fact that you make um, good choices. Three of Pentacles, Five of Swords. This definitely could be somebody you work with. Somebody's jealous. Either you work with this person or this could be one of your co-workers, your colleagues, take how it resonates. But somebody is jealous. Yes, Three of Wands at a distance. Will of Fortune and Judgment. That's something that's changing for you. They don't like it. Oof. But you have ascended. Okay? You have ascended. Eight of Wands, it came up sideways. <sighs> Somebody didn't want you to take action towards something. What's this Eight of Wands, Holy Spirit? King of Pentacles, they knew something was coming in for you. Mm -hmm. Five of Pentacles, dang. Somebody was like, how can I stop this? Somebody was, it, it's something about timing. It's something about timing as well. Somebody wants to, because it's like you you just kept growing. It's, you're growing too fast. Like your speed, it's like whatever that's happening for you, it's just like something could have just been literally like, I won't say overnight, but something is happening for you too quick. And somebody is noticing that with the moon card and they watch it. And somebody's intimidated by that. What's the five of pentacles? Ooh. Something could have happened within 18 months. You could have grown fast. Maybe you was working on something. I can't make it up. Ace of Swords, Spirit said that's the damn truth. Somebody like you just you just keep going. You're moving too fast. Somebody like, oh no, how can I? Somebody is a hater. They're jealous. They're jealous. Okay. Queen of Swords. I mean, Queen of Swords. So something can be significant about a Queen of Swords, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Tick, I resonate. Mm. But anyway, the Ace of Swords is here. Spirit said that's the damn truth. You see the truth, the clarity. Ten of Swords. Something is over with. Something is over with. Somebody feel defeated. Look, Empress, there you go. Crack the look. Somebody is mad. They wanted you to miss out on an opportunity. Damn. Mm -mm -mm. Can I have some? Let me close this. I can I have some messages for my beautiful Empress? Yeah, <laughs> gifts. Gifts will surprise you. You about to get a gift from the Most High. Spirit said your hard work is paying off, and change is um, unavoidable. This change had to happen, and somebody is somewhere looking in sorrow because you had the courage to keep going on. Beauty, I'm sorry, uh, courage and the strength to keep going. Beauty, Archangel Jophiel. This is you, Empress. Yes, somebody can't stand it. It's like it's something about your beauty, your attractiveness. Somebody is like, it's something about you that was naturally given to you by the most high. And somebody literally doesn't like you because of that. And study being mad at you. This person, it's like they mad at God. Because that's what is coming to me. It's like they mad at God because this is something that was naturally given to you. Fertility and creativity. Something about you is growing. That's that page of pentacles. That queen of wands, page of pentacles, 
the sun card. Creativity and fertility. You guys could be pregnant. If so, congratulations. For others who are not, it's just like whatever you create, whatever, whatever your creative projects, whatever you're working on is growing. It's growing. It's growing. It's growing. And, and you are attracting everything. The Empress attracts everything. The Emperor takes action. Somebody has a beautiful balance. Hmm. I love it for you guys. Anything else on the spirit? Yeah. You guys could connect with Mother Earth very well. It's something about you just like it's I'm giving <laughs> the higher friend. King of Cups. Page of Swords, the Chariot. Somebody's spirit guy is here. And they see everything. That's why you be able to move forward. It's like while they watching you. Yeah, I know I seen the earth this Queen of Swords earlier. Queen of Swords, Ace of Pentacles, Will of Fortune. Boom, there it is. Somebody knows about this new opportunity that's coming in for you that's going to change. Because I heard earlier, something that you're doing is going to literally change your whole reality, your whole life. Somebody knows about that. They do. But the thing is, see, while they're watching you, they don't know your spirit guys is watching them. God is watching them. Ooh, yeah. Mm, 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 mm. Spirit say yes. So, these, I'm going to end this reading out. I hope this reading was able to help you guys, give you guys clarity on your situation. And so we get up next time. <laughs> Later, Sunseeds. So